and I just see cop cars and ambulance zoom past me. I didn't know what was going on. Gunfire near Miami University. Two students shot. People are driving by like, does anyone know? Like, are people okay? So it was definitely concerning. The concern in Oxford started fading Wednesday afternoon when people learned the two guys who were shot were hit in the leg and will be okay. And after hearing, they were not random targets. We believe that this was, uh, uh, suspects are possibly known to the victims, uh, whether they're directly known or uh, have some type of link to them. Uh, we're still trying to figure out, but this, this was certainly not a random act. A little after 7.30 last night, a person at the home on North Campus Avenue called 911. Before the dispatcher said hello, some chatter can be heard in the background about whether the victims should even call for help. All right, go outside. They're going to come to the can't go outside. Oh, you want me to I'm calling. Can I call? I'm aware or not. Hello? Hi, bro. Hello? 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 911. Yes, um, my friend, someone just came in. I also shot my friend in the leg. The caller does not mention a second victim. Do you have any idea who shot him? No, I've never seen these people in my life. Oxford police say they were told this started over a Craigslist ad. One of the Miami students was going to buy a car for $4,000. But no smooth transaction here. Police say they were told the so-called seller pulled out a gun, there was a confrontation, shots were fired, and the men took off with the money. And those circumstances are still under investigation. Police say they're still looking for two suspects. As far as the victims, I'm told one was treated and released from a Gullah Hyde hospital. The other is recovering at Westchester Hospital. Reporting live tonight in Oxford, Karen Johnson, WLWT News 5.